Good morning. Thank you, Greg. My name is Mike Lee. I'm president and co-founder of Fundica. The number one problem that small business entrepreneurs face is finding funding. As well, the number one problem that financial institutions face is attracting and retaining clients. We are attempting to solve both those problems and make that financial institution the trusted one-stop advisor. Fundica is an AI-powered, award-winning funding search engine that is used by several of the largest financial institutions in North America. Using Fundica, these financial institutions enable small business entrepreneurs to identify and apply for government and other complementary funding, while at the same time collecting very valuable information on needs, intents of these entrepreneurs. So how do we do this? We work with tens of thousands of programs. We have funders, we have uh, bots, both discovery and tracking bots. We have a strong research team, and we have some collaborative partners. We bring all that together, and we use AI and algorithms to make it make sense of it all, to bring it, make it really useful, so that effectively our platform is both comprehensive and up to date. And the funding search results are robust and relevancy ranked. So let's dive into the, the demo. We're actually going to go to a, this is a Desjardins. They are the largest credit union in North America. And this is actually a live demo. This is on their site. Uh, there was no integration required, so this was set up very easily. And um, Desjardins has really decided to become much more than just a regular bank. They want to be that one-stop shop where people go to for funding. So on this page here, we see find funding. We click on that. There we go. And effectively we go in. And what we're going to do to make this more interesting is we're going to do a, we're going to pretend we're a young woman entrepreneur in Philadelphia. So put in Philadelphia postal code. The program we're looking at federal, we're looking at state, and we're also looking at municipal. The, founded five years ago, is in two different industries. So we're going to say um, they're in clean and renewable energies. And they're also in manufacturing. Employees, they got 30 employees. So we're really trying to get them from when they're very early. They would change the funding results up until Right number and the revenue last year, again, we start trying to identify and work with very young companies all the way up to, in this case, we're talking two million. Then they're going to put in a um, email address, and they, we put this in so that they can come back later on and actually use this in the future. Accept the terms, and then we view results. So we could go through the tutorial, but I'm going to take you through a little quicker. So we said it's a woman entrepreneur. So we're going to go in here and say woman under 40. Uh, this is all good. Uh, looking to export at this point and interested in energy efficiency. Developing and modifying products. Not really interested in work with universities at this point. Strategic transaction, neither. Uh, hiring and training, we'll leave this as well. So this is the original profile. Entrepreneur could come back and actually change some of those if the needs change for the entrepreneur. So if we look at the actual grants, there we go. Um, so some are federal, some are state. We may even have some municipal. Um, in this case, let's go take a look at this program here. Looks interesting. It's for exporting. There's a bit of description. There's funding limits. There's eligible expenditures, contact information and um, guidelines and forms. So it's, it's lots of information. They can actually also start the application right here, or there's actually a way to contact the, the funder. So this program here, we decide we like that program. We're going to click it. We could also go look at these other programs and go into different areas, tax credits, loans. These are government loans. 
loan guarantees, accelerators, and all the favorite ones that we liked are kept right here. So this is how it works for the entrepreneur, but the real magic happens on the funder side and, and the financial institution. So what they're going to see is they're going to get all this information, they're going to be able to take this information and act on it. And the information they're getting is about needs, it's about the firmographics, it's about their intent, and these entrepreneurs are all looking for funding. So they capture all this information, they bring it together, it's well organized, and you can visualize it and act on it. So if you're looking to attract new business clients, engage your current clients with relevant, dynamic, useful information, extend your website so easily, you know, if you're looking even just to capture more information that you can put back into the business. And most importantly, if you really want to become a funding champion, that reference point, please contact me or my team at fundica.com. Thank you.